Queen Elizabeth II was reportedly involved in an awkward incident in May 1991, when she was denied access to the Royal Windsor Horse Show by a security guard who allegedly explained sorry love, you can't come in without a sticker when she tried to enter. Queen Elizabeth II is the longest reigning monarch in British history. She was born on 21 April, 1926, in London, and became queen on February 6, 1952, following the death of her father, King George VI. She is the most well-traveled monarch ever and has been portrayed in a variety of films and television programs over the years. However, according to reports from 1991, a man still failed to recognize Her Majesty and refused to let her in at the Royal Windsor Horse Show. Holding up a hand to stop the black Vauxhall Carlton she had driven the 500 yards from Windsor Castle, Carl Schumann, who was working on security, reportedly told the Queen, Sorry love, you can't come in without a sticker. Opening the window, Her Majesty rebutted with a smile, I think if you check I will be allowed to come in. Explaining afterwards, Mr. Schumann claimed he thought she was an old dear who had got lost. According to the official website of the royal family, there are no obligatory codes of behavior when meeting the queen or a member of the royal family. However, it is recommended that on presentation to the queen, the correct formal address is your majesty and subsequently ma'am. Despite the breach in protocol, Mr. Schumann claimed she did not seem at all upset. It was not the only time people the Queen did not get recognized, though. When Her Majesty was on a walk near the grounds of Balmoral Castle in 2016, U.S. holidaymakers failed to recognize who she was. Richard Griffin, one of the Queen's former protection officers, claimed she played along when the tourists asked do you live around here? By replying that she had a house nearby. When asked if she had met the Queen, she simply gestured to Mr. Griffin and replied, No, but he has.